Morning, everybody. Uh, Scott with Football Scoop. Today, I've got uh, two bright young guys from uh, Northwestern football on with us. I got John Kuzieski, uh, be the offensive grad assistant this season, and McNeil Parker, our defensive grad assistant. Uh, appreciate you guys joining us. Appreciate you being here. Great. Thanks for having us. All right, you guys take pick. Um, tell me a little bit about yourselves. Who wants to go first? You know, how'd you I'll go get first. Um, so, my name is John Kuzieski. I'm the offensive graduate assistant here. Uh, originally from Libertyville, Illinois, born and raised about 30 minutes north of Evanston. Played, uh, played football there, was a captain uh, on a state championship team, where actually my dad was also the head coach, so it was a pretty cool experience. Had the chance to kind of play some either Ivy League or D3 ball, but decided to go to a big school instead and, uh, and work with the program. Went to uh, Penn State as an undergrad, started as a manager, kind of worked my way into an on-the-field role, uh, basically starting uh, working with the D-line and then actually running the scout teams for the defense. So it was a good opportunity there, working under Coach Paterno and, and Coach Johnson with the defensive line. Uh, came here, uh, had a chance to volunteer, worked with the uh, special teams and the running backs to start, and then uh, got hired as a quality control, uh, kind of helping Coach Cushing in the offensive line. And then this past spring, I was hired as a graduate assistant and worked with the wide receivers here in the spring. So, McNeil, how about you, bud? I'm also from around here, about 30 minutes north. I played uh, Lake Forest High School. I actually played John in high school. And, it wasn't uh, much of a game. It wasn't much of a game. <laughs> Uh, yeah, they were really good in high school. Uh, and then I went to uh, Kenyon College, a uh, small D3 in Ohio. Played football there. I played uh, wide receiver safety there. Uh, then in between junior and senior year of college, I came here and interned here over the summer and then was welcomed back here as a recruiting assistant. Uh, spent the past two summers do, uh, years doing a recruiting assistant with the team, doing everything with recruiting, helping out the different coaches and uh, doing different stuff with that. And then this past spring, I got um, asked to be the defensive GA. I'm going to be working with Coach Brown on the defensive backs uh, this upcoming year. That's great, guys. Good stuff. All right, guys, tell me, uh, you know, what, what are you guys working on right now? We're in early May. You know, what uh, most coaches on the road, what are you guys doing? So, uh, yeah, we're doing a little bit of everything. Um, basically, I already uh, broken down the first two opponents for next year. Have those ready for the, uh, the coordinator. He's going to get back in today, and he's back off the road, so he'll get a jump on them. And then as a staff, we'll kind of go through the first three opponents in June as we're doing our camps. So we got all that film already broken down. And then I'll actually working on like a kind of a four-year self-scout uh, for the head coach, just kind of tendencies and everything we've been doing there. And then other than that, it's uh, kind of recruiting for basically the entire offensive staff, call coach, set up an appointment, you know, get me grades on this kid, that kind of thing. So it's a, kind of a full day. And then uh, also helping out in the weight room in the mornings uh, with our workouts with our guys. So be around them a little bit in the morning. So it's, uh, it's a pretty action-packed day right now. How about you, Neil? Yeah, a lot of the same thing. Um, I'm working a lot with the defensive coaches to help set up recruiting trips, uh, especially when we're sending coaches out of their normal recruiting areas to go recruit their position. We're working with the other coaches to help coordinate what time he could go see the school, what uh, coach he's going to see, and what kind of players, their grades, and everything that way. And then doing the uh, breakdowns as well for the defensive side and kind of getting through first three opponents and really kind of having games ready for the coaches to get going when they get off the road here coming up. Hey, uh, when, uh, when the full-time, you know, get, when full-time guys get off the road and you guys take, you know, they find a little vacation, you guys get a little vacation time too? Yeah, actually we do. Uh, it's, it's pretty nice. After our last day at camp, we get about three weeks. We have a couple of office days that we need to come in and just kind of either help with any recruiting or, just around the office activities, but yeah, we get we get about three weeks off end of, end of June to you know right before the season, right week before camp starts, uh, which is pretty nice, especially being uh, around Chicago here. Yeah. It's a good place to have a summer off, uh, comparable to some other campuses. So you're right about that. All right, guys, tell me about uh, you know what what makes you happy. You know, you go home at the end of the day and you say, I had a great day today. You know, what does that for you? I think. I really enjoy just being around the guys and being able to provide influence the team and really help the team get better. And I think uh, I know I have a, had a good day if I can come back and say, hey, I really helped the coaches do this. I really helped the team progress this way. I really influenced a kid and made him think about this and make him better. Um, and just when you can see yourself go into a day and make the team better, the program better, do something to help in whatever capacity, either GA, recruiting, well, however you it, it happens, that's really uh, a great way to really feel like you're a part of the team and doing something and do bigger than yourself. Yep. Who's that about you, bud? Uh, for me, 
Uh, my dad was a high school coach for 30 years at the same school, head coach for 15. So I actually came, come from a big family of educators, mom's teacher, sisters of teachers. So it's kind of the, the obviously game of football is the best game in the world, hands down. And it's fun just to be watching them and watching our guys play it every day. But it's more for me as having a, a mentor role and a, and, a, and a role in a kid's life. Because at this point in their lives, 18 to 22, a lot's a lot's changing. They're making decisions for the rest of their life, whether they're ready or not. And it's a, it's a good time to be able to influence them and talk with them. And, and especially here, we got a great group of guys. Uh, and it's just an awesome opportunity to be a mentor and, and, and to really to make an impact in their lives. Great, uh, great having you guys on today. I appreciate you guys finding a few minutes. You guys keep rolling up there, all right? All right, thank you very much for having us. All right.